He's 21 now. He was born a traumatic birth and had um, anoxia at birth, so he is very motor involved. We did realize that he was in there, like, you know, he couldn't do a lot of the milestones as he was growing up and was diagnosed with cerebral palsy, but very social and has a great sense of humor. Before Neuronode, we would just use a lot of physical, like physically picking things up. Do you want the milk or the water? And he would make choices by eye gaze. During the pandemic, we were doing virtual classes with him at, at his school, and his speech therapist introduced us to the Neuronode. So Christy came to us maybe in 2019. She's our regional representative and she did an in-service for the speech department introducing us to the trilogy and the Neuronode and uh, it was really brand new technology for us and it was exciting because the population that we serve here at our school is mostly medically fragile, uh, multiply disabled students. When we first trialed him on it we had an evaluation and we essentially set him up on that same access point that he was familiar with how he activated his single message output device and he realized quickly, I barely have to move my arm for this to turn on. It's easier for him, less fatigue, less frustration, uh, it's quicker. It also keeps his whole posture at midline. Um, because he just has to do that little quick rotation, he's able to look at his device, he's able to look at his communication partner. What do you think of the camera being here? Wow, cool. <laughs> Even the Neuronode can accommodate for like the extra movements that he might make, which is very nice because otherwise it would just be going off like constantly. This, is, this device is something that we've really been waiting for in this school because of our population. Um, Ryan, like other students that are here, we know that his cognition is higher. We know his receptive language is higher. And this system, because it uh, reduces the demands on the motor system, it allowed him to express himself faster and, and we got to really see how high that cognition is. Control Bionics offered us a 30-day trial where he got to take the device home, he got to bring it back into school for therapy, he had it for 30 days and that's something that's really unique to this uh, system, to this company and I think it, it benefited the family enormously. He can express himself now and you know, we're, everyone is just excited to see what he has to say. I want to get better at my device so I can hang out with friends and talk to people in my community. He has the capability of that, of making his own choices and making them known is tremendous, life-changing.